Hey guys, so I wanted to come on here and share with you why I hadn't been posting any videos this week. Um, well, this past week I had just been super crazy and didn't get a chance to edit the videos that I planned on or shoot the videos that I planned on shooting. Um, but also we had a death in the family of someone who I was extremely, extremely close to this person. I. I grew up with this person most of my life and he is a, was a wonderful, 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 wonderful man and somebody that I looked up to a lot in my life. He was a very gracious person and he was very understanding. He loved, he loved spending time with the, his grandkids and his, um, great nieces and nephews and grand nieces and nephews and all that kind of stuff so that's just really the reason why I didn't hadn't posted anything so far it's just been it's been kind of a whirlwind we weren't really expecting him to to pass away I mean he was he was very old he lived he lived a wonderful wonderful life um, but it's still kind of hard when somebody in your family passes on. And I say pass on because um, in my beliefs, you know, they're, and then once they're, if they're saved, you know, they're gonna go to heaven and they're gonna live another life up there. And he is, you know, with family members that have passed on before us, it's still, it's still hard because And I didn't really cry a whole lot at the funeral, and sometimes I do and sometimes I don't. I'll probably end up losing it or something later on this, this probably this weekend, and, you know, just because, you know, I, the way I look at it, you know, like he said, he's led a wonderful life, and he, he was kind of like, not the matriarch, because that's a female, I don't know what the male version of that would be of our family. He was pretty, he was the oldest living family member we had. And it'll be kind of sad because our family won't be getting together as much because we won't be getting together to celebrate his birthdays and things like this. So we're, it's gonna be a new, interesting. And one of the things that he said, um, when his grandkids said at the funeral was that his family is his legacy and that's true we are his legacy and I have, I have really fond memories of him going you know I used to go over to his house and he would buy stuff at auctions just like my grandpa would and I would always love to go in his garage and see what new stuff he had bought and if there's any toys or anything like this and I'd love to go and listen to his stories and you know because he told the way he told the story was wonderful, and you know it's still it's still really kind of difficult just because it's like okay you know he's not there anymore he's been there for so long and now he's not. And what's sad is my kids didn't really get to know him like I got to know him. He's great. And that's that's probably the saddest the saddest part is that my kids won't get to know him like I did. And I that's something I always wanted. I wanted them to get to know him and stuff. And I'm not saying who it is just in privacy of my family because, you know, but I just wanted to, you know, I just wanted to tell you guys why I hadn't been uh, making many videos and things. Um, and what makes me sad is I didn't get, I didn't get a chance to say goodbye. And I really wish I could have gotten a chance to go down and visit him, but we just, it was just too far, so at that time so um yeah i'm gonna hope to get back to some of my regularly videos 
and everything here in the next couple of days but just you know it'd be nice to have some process time to you know process all this and everything so but I want to thank you guys you know my subscribers for sticking around and not leaving me when I hadn't put up hmm, when I hadn't put up any new videos so I hope you guys have a great day or great tomorrow because it's like almost midnight I hope you guys have a great night and um Hopefully I will catch you guys later on in my upcoming videos. So, see you guys later. Bye.